people pull up here and they are instantly greeted by three dogs and sometimes they're like, what? Where, where are we? I find the food comes first and then they realize we're on the farm and then they're like, oh my god, like this is a really unique experience. This one's one of my favorite ones to find because the like stem is all curly and weird. It's beauty and imperfection for sure. <laughs> Soil is like kind of like the base of like everything really. Yeah, like all of our food that's ever touched our plate comes from an aspect of soil. The healthier the grass is or anything that's grown, hay or anything, the better quality is that the animal's eating or whether like vegetables are grown in it, the better it's going to taste and ultimately the better it's going to be for us to serve it. The biggest thing I think that like we really focus on is sourcing that quality ingredient and getting it as fresh as possible. Like here's some. But this is a saffron milk cap. So when you find them, they're usually very vibrant orange and you can kind of see like a little bit of divot and they kind of have like little bumps here. They just have like a beautiful color. Joel, where'd you go? Just over here. So this is a puffball mushroom. This one is fairly young. And then so we'll peel this off, kind of cut it up and fry in some beautiful uh, grass-fed butter tonight. And then we're gonna take this squeeze bottle, which is just um, this beautiful cold pressed canola oil, some organic uh, apple cider vinegar, and just some local honey. And we're gonna just kind of give it a little glaze. It's great to make people feel like warm and welcome through food. We really focus on like kind of breaking that restaurant model and creating an experience where people will kind of come to. So hopefully that kind of sets us above other people as a place that you go to eat, as like a culinary destination. We are Sumac and Salt. We, uh, we kind of started this little food project not knowing exactly where we were going or what we were doing, but we and really... And we still don't. And we still don't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, super like, I have no idea. But we really wanted to kind of showcase um, what's in our area.